Hey gang. Well, here we are outside the old CV's building and it definitely looks a lot different than it did uh, well over a year ago. Of course, we closed down. And it's amazing how it took over a year for anybody to really come in here and start trying to work on this place and do anything with it. As you guys can see, it looks like there's, uh, let's see, are these windows or can we, can we, can we tell? You? I guess it looks like doors. So there's, there's word going out that, um, uh, what I'm saying, they're going to try and turn into a partial grocery store and the other three parts there will be something else. You know, it'd be nice if it was a laundromat because I would like to walk up here instead of walking all the way down toward, towards past the police station to, uh, to do my laundry and stuff. It'd be a whole lot easier to just walk up here and, you know, it would be really nice if, it, if this was open 24 seven too. Um, but yeah, again, lots of word about what's going on with this place. Uh, no official word has come out yet about what they're turning this place into. And hopefully they're going to do something good with it. Uh, a lot of times when they, when they turn old buildings into something else, uh, it doesn't usually last very long. So like I said in the last video, I'm just going to wait until a sign comes out that says what this place is going to officially be before, before I will believe anything. Because, you know, you always got these small town rumors going around. Of people saying it's going to be this, it's going to be this, it's going to be this, it's going to be this. And here in Boonville, it's no different because they love to exaggerate uh, these rumors and stuff. So whatever they turn it into, hopefully it's going to be a, a good, solid business. It's going to be around for a long, long time. And like I said, if it's another grocery store, it's something this town definitely needs. Because you got too many people complaining about, you know, Walmart being the only place here. And I'm like, well, Dollar General's there too, but not too many people want to shop there for some reason. But yeah, the old CVs is finally getting some work done to it. And well, what is it going to be? Who knows? But I'll try and keep you guys updated as often as I can. And when an official something pops out here saying this is what the place is going to be, I'll do a video on that one for you guys. And uh, yes, I'm, yes, I still can't believe they actually had these signs out here that says no loitering, no trespassing. And yet, <laughs> and yet during the entire time, this place had nothing to it. There were people sitting out here, cars parked out here, everything like that. It's amazing. This, this, this town just never ceases to be one of the stupidest towns you could ever live in. But I'm going to get on out of here, gang. Thanks for watching, everybody. God bless you all. Hope you're having an awesome day. Hope you enjoyed the video. And if you like my videos, please feel free to subscribe. Let's stop destroying the world. Let's stop those really need it right now. Let's keep praying on the virus, pandemic, disease, scary nonsense. We'll stop one day soon. And whether or not you believe in God, he believes in you. If you want to have a fellow YouTuber, reach 100 subscribers, 1,000 subscribers, 10,000, 100,000 subscribers. Any goals you want to try to achieve this year or in life in general, hope you get there get there real, real soon. Make sure it's legal. Nobody gets hurt. Express yourself. And remember, here for a reason. If you weren't here, you would be missed. Always stay true to yourself. Take care of yourselves. Try to be good. Try to be good yourself. Try to be good to others. Till we do this again, as always, stay strong and rock on.